anyways, it is uh, 4.40, so uh, let's uh, let's begin with our usual accoutrements. Uh, as usual, folks, we have our dear friends here. Uh, we have Alex. Logan. We have Queen. I was about to say Among Us backwards and then couldn't figure it out. Sugoma. <laughs> And we have Uprising. You're so sussy. I know you took my Fortnite card. My $19 <laughs> <told me> Fortnite card. <laughs> yep, as usual, bottom right hand corner, card deck. Donate. Fill up that donation bar with 2,000 bits, 20 United States dollars, or the like. And we will draw a card from that deck. Uh, additionally, if $20 are donated straight up, we will cameo a character from another stream uh and like i said before scott and shiner will be here later and we eat them. i think that's all yeah no we did not eat them wrong stream anyways let's uh let's go back to our uh to our thing shall we heck let's do a little shift click so that we can so that nobody has to Scroll. Oh Thank shit, you. yeah, this is the thing. <laughs> okay. So, when we last left off, uh, Angel Eyes revealed herself. She took off her mask. And now, it is time for bloodshed. Oh, that's right. She did take off her mask. Boop! Token's got two sides. Token's got two sides. <laughs> She's beautiful. Alright. So. It is now player phase. Okay. Also, I moved everybody up. Uh, I'll move everybody up for the sake of everyone not having to spend nine million turns just moving. <laughs> so, yeah. Are you, if you're... If you want to change around positions, you can, again. Seeing where everything is. Um... Um... Ooh. ooh. Oh, wow, we've got, really got a mix on both sides, so... Yep. Is this... Is this counting as combat starting again? Um... It's a continuation of the, la of the current map, so combat's not starting again. Okay, cool. But, it, but because it's such a big map, I'm gonna I'm gonna ask that you, I'm gonna ask if you uh, want to change positions here. Uh, if anyone wants to swap with Una, feel free. Yeah, let's probably get Una to the back because she's got physic and can heal just fine yeah. from back there. Okay, so maybe switch her with Mitty then. Yeah, sure. Wait. wait, wait. Hey. That way. Hey, why can't? There we go. <laughs> All right, now we have a bruiser on the front lines, a healer in the bat and the rear guard. Uh, did you say something, Uprising? No, I changed my mind. Okay. Um. Well. Huh. Apparently, I'm crackling now. Okay. Uh. Yep. Yep. I've been. I'm still doing some calculation. Okay. Audio subsystem set to legacy. Turned off Ooh. the uh, echo cancellation and noise reduction, so I don't know what's going on. Strange. Do you have your voice mod on? I do. It's probably that then. Yeah, it's. 
Some days it plays nice, some days it doesn't. This must be awful. one of those days where it doesn't. All right, let's uh, let's see if that helps. All right. Yeah. Uh, I'd say getting Audrey and Folky somewhere close to the front would help because they need experience. Mm -hmm. okay. Yes, Folky's level sixteen. Yeah, Folky <laughs> yes, really Folky needs experience. Needs Folky needs to level up. All right. Uh, um. So, which side do you want to put them on? Or... Um. There's a delicious, delicious red tome unit on the right. Yeah. Uh, all right. Dark Knight B. So that because he needs to have. You're really quiet for me now. Yeah. Let me move my microphone. <laughs> that would help. Yeah, my setup is really wide. <laughs> Fair enough. So uh, I gotta talk out of this. I gotta talk out of the my mouth like this, like perfectly. <laughs> Stop. I also have a wide setup. I know the pain. <laughs> my setup is me on a couch. Same. Well, uh, two monitors, so I gotta. <laughs> yeah, totally goes. Laptop supremacy. Yeah. Well, so I got um, a laptop too, but you know, I got my tablet pen. Yes. Cool. Yeah, I'm. I think both fine where he is. Okay. I'll move. The, I'll move the other Phineas down here with uh, the other Phineas and switch Audrey with Constantine, if that's right. all right. Works for me. Uh, I'm also gonna move. I'm also gonna switch Charles and Noah just so that uh, Meanir can also get the armored march boost. Yep. We should we should probably have someone tanky up on the left side to support Audrey because Angel Eyes and Mihal are not tanky. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Who's tanky then? Uh, well, obviously they're tanks. Did someone say tanks? Tanks. Yes. Exist. Let's put <laughs> let's put Una up front. <laughs> Una has surprisingly high stats, of course, but you know. I will punch them all. Actually, Una's bulk is really good. <laughs> Una's bulk is amazing. Like, listen, Lisa, this is her bulk. 55, 47, 52 bulk. <laughs> oh my god. She's actually, she's actually fairly tanky. I am Una the tankiest never... of tanks. Una will never die. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. And I suppose having Una up there to, like, help. Help, okay. like, heal and then, like, wreck and perhaps rescue if, if, possible, if necessary. We might sure. need some rescue staffs in this particular section, yes. Yeah. I'll I'll move Allison then. Okay. Put her up there because they do the armored units as well, so I'm not gonna actually switch her with Constantine. Mm -hmm. And then mm. I'll actually put Quartza down here because she has the uh the physics staff. And Constantine can also get the uh, armor march boost. It is time for fast. The bear is fast for Mother Russia. <laughs> All right. And um, I'm keeping the cameo mutants because technically this is a uh, this is a continuation of the last map of well, the current map. Yeah. So yeah. All right. Uh, other than that, is everybody ready to go? Yep. We should be. Okay. Then let's uh, let's go. It's now player phase. Cool. Just plugging in some mage numbers real quick. All right. Thank you. Okay. So Angelites can take out one of these cavalry units, and we'll probably need help to get away from that. Okay. Oh, also... Denzel can have some perfume rally. Okay. 
Okay, so Denzel, Maxine, Edward, Mike, Bridget, and uh, Noah, and uh, Mjolnir all have plus two to their movement. Bo just has this sudden motivation, God knows what, to just douse him in perfume. Just. Got to go fast! <laughs> Got to go fast! <laughs> Got to go fast! Gotta go fast. He's just this poor guy just smelling like a fucking flower garden with all the perfume he's got. <laughs> <laughs> it's just I whopping into Delicious face. <laughs> <laughs> I am a flower garden of sadness. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Wait. um two, three, four, five. I'm gonna move Bo like down here. Okay. Alex, I believe you said you wanted to attack the cavalry. Uh, just deciding which one. I'm debating between the Holy Knight and Gold Knight down here, because I'm pretty sure she can reach both. Yeah, yeah, she can reach both, no problem. Yeah, they're not very far away, so... Nope. But first, I'm going to go ahead and make an educated guess... The uh, fortress knight that's in its circle of buddies. Does he have armor march? He does have armor march, yes. Cool! <laughs> that's what I thought! <laughs> plank, 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 plank. No, I don't want to draw. Get, dang it. Draw and get out of here. So. Ooh! Ooh. <laughs> eh. <laughs> eh. <laughs> Whoops, I uh, accidentally uh, backspace, uh, backpaged from the roll 20. Uh, yeah, I will say Angel Eyes can take out one of these cavalry, but we'll probably need uh, rescue to get out of that. Yes, because uh, Armour Marsh, bad. <laughs> mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, um, well... There we go. <laughs> what are the stats of this Dark Knight? Dark Knight stats are as follows. Uh, da -da -da -da. First of all, uh, Cavalry Mage stats are... Um, 63 HP... 48 attack, 26 speed, 13 defense, and 52 res. And this Dark Knight has a skill set, so let me uh, go ahead and copy that in. Uh, where's Discord? There it is. Uh, ba -ba -ba, I need build log. Ah. Uh, nothing that will scare Falky. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And let me get to actually get the uh, Fortress Knight as well. So I could wait for the next turn or dance her with Lean and then attack now. I mean, as long as somebody's there to take out the Mage Knight as well, so... Should be fine. Uh... Who could reach the Mage? I think only Mur. Yeah. I'm pretty sure no one else can reach the Mage Knight in time. Okay. 
We are in a bit like, of a predicament. <laughs> yeah, we are. Because I was like, oh, I could dance I could dance him, but then it's like, no, I can't. You still wouldn't be able to go far enough. Uh, he does have armor marks, so he is a gotta go best man. Yes. Oh. The beyond your zone can now move seven spaces. Oh. So we can actually reach the Mage Knight and move the Meander zone. We can, yep. yeah. Okay, but yeah. let's do that. Alrighty. Uh, is it eating time? <laughs> bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. Bonk. Bonk. Alrighty. Positioning for the zone. Alright, are you attacking? I am attacking. Alright. Then let's uh let's go ahead and calc this then. So it's cavalry mage, so 50, 52 res. Right. Uh, attack is uh, Meander's attack, forty four. Four. I'm trying to remember if his special should be lower at this point. I don't remember. Huh. No. It would not be enough to sugar ether, I don't think. So. Oh, well. Uh, let's see. So the cavalry unit's got a 52 res. So it's going to be 12 damage in the mage knight. Chipping him down to 52. And let me see. Beyond your speed. Speed is 30. 30. So... And uh, not enough to double. Just barely not, not enough. enough. Yeah, not quite enough. So, you get... Da -da. Beyond your level is 22. Because it's 24, so 75 experience points. 75? Yes, correct. Okay, that's the level up. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Now Incredible, he leveled up speed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but he leveled up defense twice. Yes, <laughs> excellent. <laughs> Looks like and my training paid just... off. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed. Now the mage knight is stuck on the Meander zone. He cannot attack Bulky. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Uh, the Holy Knight, I think, can reach a greater number of people on the left, so I think that's going to be Angel's target. Okay. So go ahead and move her over. Cool. And, and if you're attacking with a Flame Shuriken, I'm almost certain this is a kill. Yeah, probably. <laughs> yeah. Woo, time saving. So Angel, as you look the Holy Knight directly in the eyes, he is shocked, <laughs> shocked to say the least. However... Uh, that look of shock fades when Angel Eyes kills him. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Woo! I would have never guessed. <laughs> it, it's hard to be shocked when you're dead. Anyways, 75 experience points. 75 experience points. That's a level up. I believe the plan was to rescue him. Yes. Please use the rescue staff on Angel Eyes. Oh, but I'm not really feeling like it today. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Alright. 
Zoop. All right. So... All right you wanna, for rescuing angel eyes, you get experience. Uh, Does using rescue activate still water bomb? Um. Yes, technically, uh, it's a staff. So. Ta-da! Ta-da. <laughs> Everyone has still water bomb. All of you have res. <laughs> Yards. All right, so Una gets fifty experience points. Fifty. Fifty, yeah, yes. Uh, that is not a level up. Uh, <laughs> it's close though. You get one experience, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I would. You would be dead. <laughs> and how much SP do I get for rescue? Um, four. Four, so eight. Your support brilliant. staff gives you a base of four. Okay. Cool. Thank you. Oh, wait. Nope, just four because I'd swap tags. <laughs> I'm a dum dum. Um, is Tristana our only unit with lockpick, or do we have others? Uh, she's our one unit with lockpick. Okay. Which enemies have uh, locks to the chests? The chest keys? Um, yeah. I'll tell you when if I I'll, I'll tell you when you find them, but uh, uh, actually, actually, hang on. Okay. Okay. So this gold knight has a chest key. This guardian knight has a chest key. Okay. What about the chest near the Martha Diggs? The Martha Diggs. Uh, the Cantor has the chest key to that one. Of course he does. Okay, well then, we shouldn't really have to worry about sending Tristana over then, because they're on the way. We'll be, we'll be doing that natural kind of murder on the way there. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, as opposed to the unnatural kind of murder. Mm -hmm. So, uh, so I had an idea. Angel Eyes' okay. personal skill, uh, along with giving extra attack, adds her attack to, uh, the to her allies whenever they're attacked in enemy phase. So we could have Audrey yeah. park in front of her and be a super death tank. Oh my god. Alright. Everybody in, in consensus on this one? Yeah. Alright. Super death tank time it is. Super death tank. Pretty sure Earth Bunker triggers too, because he's taking the weight action. Yes. So now he has more defense. Alright. Just to give uh, that Guardian Knight less options. Yeah. So that Una doesn't get attacked. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'll go ahead and have Mihal equip the Zanbato, then. <laughs> <laughs> it is time for horse slaying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. That is him done. Um, how, how do we want to split this left and right? I guess Leon can go left, because Lean is right. Okay. Yep. Works for me. That gold knight has relatively little range. I think as long as you don't advance too far past uh, past this blockade, we'll be fine. Mm hmm So he can go... How many spaces? Eight? Eight. Yes. Wow. That's a lot of spaces. Yeah. He's on a horse. I'm on a horse. He's ready to commit horse-related violence. Father, it 
this time. Of course, violent. I would suggest, at least for now, starting to split up the finny eye. Okay, yeah, I, I was about to say, do you want to split them up? Yes. Okay, so where do you want to put them? Uh, the... So, I'm just gonna check some attack ranges real quick. And I'm gonna check Phineas's reds real quick. <laughs> okay. And Phineas's res is. 42. 42, yes. Could you get me the stat block on that Dark Bishop A, please? Yes, of course. Thank uh, you. Dark Bishop A. This is a this is a promoted mage, so 63 HP. 52 attack, 41 speed, 11 defense, and 51 res. And the skills are as follows. Da -da -da. Where is the build block? There it is. Dark A, okay. A? Whoops. Didn't format ah. that right, but okay. <laughs> okay! That... That's gonna be real risky to put videos up there. Yeah. <laughs> um... Ah, okay, so. Hades Omega is a weapon, for sure. I'm doing. Yeah, I'm uh, doing let, some let me math. get it for you. Hades. Thank you. Alright, so seven, it, it's got 17 might. Oh, uh, but Jesus. It reduces, yeah, it reduces <laughs> attack by 50% into the next combat. Huh. I don't think Phineas would take that hit very well. Yeah, let's not put him there. I, I would hate to have Scott come back and it's like, hey, Scott, oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, Phineas, Phineas is did dead. not make it. Hi, hi Scott, Phineas is dead? <laughs> we uh, accidentally I switched also, the game to yeah. classic mode while you were also, gone. I wouldn't put Lugetta there because the Dark Bishop <laughs> can move six spaces. Oh. Yeah, this Dark Bishop scares me. <laughs> Oh. Back it up, back it up. <laughs> back up the horse. I'm going to I'm going to stand next to Constantine. I feel safe here. Yes. Better makes you very safe. Maybe it could go close to Lilietta, I think. <laughs> close to Lilietta, but not close enough to get Hades Omega in the face. <laughs> no. <laughs> I keep forgetting how freaking huge their range is. It's impossible. Yeah, mages are dangerous. They were, they were, they're super dangerous in uh, Shadows of Valentia. They're magically dangerous. Uh, uh. Phineas. Uh, Phineas Replica can go below Mitzi. That should okay. be safe for him. Leaves Tristana, Charles, Trixie, and Denzel and Noah. I don't want to move Denzel anyway. There's a Hades Omega man. 
<laughs> You're right. <laughs> I shall fight for justice, but not that much. Yeah. Now, Denzel absolutely would in character, but we've got a lot of map to go, and I don't want to lose Denzel right now. <laughs> He just like starts charging and until he's just, until he's just like, no. Yeah. For just grabs him by the collar, pulls him back. <laughs> the justice. We, no, you are not. Not today. No. No justice. I don't really want to move Noah anywhere either. <laughs> yeah. Hades don't make him. He can move slightly to the right. No, he cannot. <laughs> You're just saying that so you can trick us. No, 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 like, further to the right. Way further to the right. Well, that's not slightly. If he wanted to go to the left of Murr, he could. He sure could. So that he'd be standing in the way of a whole bunch of cavalry. Well, that's his decision, isn't it? It is, yeah. Well, no, what do you think? I don't know. <laughs> well, it wouldn't kill Noah, so thank thankfully. So, uh, if you guys wanted to come, want to come, do you guys want to do that? Uh, I'd say I don't see why not. So Noah has been moved significantly to the right. He has been moved eastward. I think Tristana might be most helpful to the right as well. See where I can put her, that way, where she won't get destroyed. Alright, so right next to, right up next to the Enzo, uh, no, it was. And then there's Trixie and Charles. I don't think Trixie needs to move anywhere. She's got the warp staff. Yeah, yeah. she has the warp staff! Mm -hmm. She can just go anywhere she wants. Oh wait, I've got the boldest of moves for Trixie. You'll never believe my amazing strategy. What? Just right there. Oh! <laughs> this is why I have the big brain, Blitz! <laughs> Actually, I'm Charles. Make an executive decision here. Use the rewarp staff. Mm. And... I'm gonna... Have Daphne warp somewhere. Probably in the way of one of the mages. I'm thinking Daphne. Charles as a red archer is going to be most useful to the left. Okay. I'm going to put Daphne to block people. Play, block off the... the I can't move Charles. So. Uh, where do you want to move Charles then? I don't know, some are, some are safe, but useful. Okay. Um, I'm also just moving Nazera down a bit, because yeah, yeah. she's in range of the Gold Knight currently. She wants to be alone, though. She doesn't want to be next to Charles. There we go. <laughs> Much better. Wait. Up here, I think that's, yeah, that's, that's out of range of the Gold Knight. Now. Warp. You over here. And give Trixie some experience for that. So let's see. Character stats 39. Trixie is level 19. So it's going to be. 19 and 19. Trixie levels up! 
Hey. Uh, can you get a little closer to the mic, by the way? You're coming in quiet. Oh, sorry. Gonna, Thank you. Gonna, that's how to scoot that in a bit more. Thanks. I'm just going to actually turn myself up a bit uh, since I'm going to be looking back and forth between my two screens. and right. Got to have that a uh, crispity, crispity crunch. This significantly, I say significantly, but reduces the threat range of Hades Omega by a little bit. So behold, my bold strategy. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> justice a little bit very quietly justice okay well if that's the case it is now enemy phase goes to check goes to compare the res stats of the three possible targets of the dark bishop Four possible targets of the Dark Bishop. Okay, so let's see. Stats of Folky. Res, res is 34, but she has open triangle advantage. Uh, stats Res of Lean is 42. The Res of uh, Latifa is 53. Ain't gonna touch that. <laughs> and the Res of uh, uh, Maxine is 49. So this Dark Bishop is going to come down, attack Fulky. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Alright, so. Fulky's stats are 38. Six minus three. Uh, the attack is Mage's attack is fifty two and seventeen. This is going to be a working triangle disadvantage. It's going to be a hit of twenty five plus life and death. Plus 10 flat damage. So that's going to be 35 damage on Fulky for the first hit. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, jeez. For the first hit, huh? Uh, Fulky's speed is... 36. Now it's 44. Oh, right. The stat, bo the stat bonuses. Hang on. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's her actual speed. Why isn't it updating? Oh, wait, we also had... Never mind. We we don't count Stillwater Bomb because of low risk. Yeah. Dude. Oh, I'm look. I'm dumb. Th 44 speed. I was looking at her defense. <laughs> 44 speed. So that's just one. Just a one hit. Thank God. Yeah. Whew. I still need to. Oh, wrong app. I'm just getting the calculator up. Yeah. All right. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> and, uh, the Queen's Wi Fi just died. Well, that's not good. Nope. Queen's Wi Fi <laughs> is folky. Oh, boy. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. Blue? What? what routes did that Dark Bishop take to try and hit Bulky? <gasps> oh! Try it oh. again! It's try it illegal. again, boy! It's oh. illegal! It's illegal! <laughs> you can't hit Bulky! He broke the He's law! He's in the Pioneer Zone! <laughs> he broke the law! <laughs> Stop! You have violated the law! <laughs> well, the only other target is, uh... One, two, three, four, five, six. And Maxine has is thick. She has a lot of health. She's not gonna go down in one hit, even though even though this is like a 
So it's actually, all stored in her boobies. <laughs> Behold, my health bazongas. <laughs> Work. Circus girls built different. <laughs> all right, so that's gonna be. All right, so that's gonna be. Whoa, forty-four plus ten. That's gonna be fifty-four damage on Oof. Maxine. Good thing she's built different. However, she does lull the speed, but not enough to uh, do the thing. Not enough to defeat the. Uh, not enough to avoid the follow-up attack. Oh. <laughs> Rip. Okay. Well, that's fifty-four damage in the first hit. Oops. <laughs> Oops! <laughs> she has huge health bazongas, Dark Bishop. I'm about to do what's called a pro gamer move, Life and Death 3. And the Dark Bishop strikes again with dark magic, knocking Maxine off her horse. Ah! It's a very suggestive. Um... No. <laughs> she falls to the ground. And she, she turns towards the, she turns towards the Phineas. She turns to Phineas. I'm sorry, Phineas. I'll have to, I'll have to go warn the others. And treat my wounds. And she retreats. And Phineas says something like, Maxine! And he's like, darn you. I am angry, sad. I am sangry. Well, at least the Dark Bishop can't move anymore. And also, we didn't lose a player character. Yep. Yes. Anyways, this Dark Bishop's gonna make a legal move. <laughs> oh, you're approaching me. Cannot make a follow-up attack, of course. Bulk is faster. Be Red Tone Breaker. <laughs> so. Mm -hmm. Alright, so let's see. So, 50. Attack. No, bunch of res. Uh... And the weapon was a uh, Banshee, Banshee Theta, Banshee, Ten Might. Alright, so it's going to be Ten Might. Bulky's res was 34. No lull skills going on here. And then, so it's going to be... 26 damage on Bulky. And that's it. It's certainly not well, what I would like, but it's better. 20, 26? Hang on. Yeah. Is, some, is something wrong with the calculation? I think uh, I think we calculated triangle advantage. Did we? Huh. Yeah. Oh, what happened to the formula? <laughs> uh oh. So, okay, 16. I stand corrected. <laughs> oh. Well, that's much better. Yes, that's much better. However... Fol Folky's health is having a weird day. <laughs> Folky, Folky, are you okay? No! No! Speaking of Folky's health, Folky, Lean, and Mur are all inflicted with deep wounds. So what Ow. that does is you cannot heal until the next until your next action. Ow. And That's also sad. savage blow triggers. So lean takes twelve damage. Forty-eight. Mur takes twelve damage. Forty-five. And yeah. That's it. Okay, so Mage Knight is gonna move slightly to the left and attempt to attack Mianir. Aha! Uh -huh. Aha! Uh Aha! -huh. Aha! Uh Aha! -huh. Aha! Uh Aha! -huh. Uh -huh. So, Alex, Mia what is Mianir's resistance? Mianir's resistance is fifty-six plus still okay. water balm. So, which is which is equal sixty, which is with weapon triangle disadvantage. So yeah, plus water breath, which is plus four. <laughs> 
The Pig. Mage Knight does zero damage to Mjolnir. That is all. <laughs> Alright. This Holy Knight is going to come down and attack Daphne. Tink, 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 tink. Daphne. Alright, so let's see. Calvary. 50, 12 versus Daphne's. Not 23. Wrong sequence of numbers that I typed in. Uh, da, 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 da. Character stats. Where are you? Daphne, there you are. 64 defense. <laughs> We're going to be hearing a lot of tink this turn. Uh, no bonuses there. This is going to be with weapon triangle advantage. All right, so that's not going to be a tink. However, it's not a lot of damage compared to Daphne's health. Okay, is your internet back? Yes. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. The internet is... At least the internet's back. Woo! That was close. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. So, let's see. Uh, Daphne. So, she takes five damage from that. <laughs> because of the damage reduction. It's taking her down to... 57. And now, Eclipse is ready. Alright, so let's see. Character stats. 58. What's Eclipse? Uh, it's Daphne's special. Basically, it takes away 80% of your defense. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it's very good. Your 50 defense, defense is now 10 defense. <laughs> your 50 defense is now 10 defense. Triangle disadvantage hit. It's gonna be 49 damage on the Holy Knight. So Daphne takes her sword, slashes this Holy Knight. The Holy Knight's down to 18 HP. And the next hit. Yep. What happened there? Uh, oh, I, I, hang on, hang on. I forgot to account for fierce stats. 54 damage, I mean. So. Thirteen, actually. And then the next hit. Eh, not as big, but you know, still just enough to kill. And Daphne is back to one cooldown. <laughs> this Gold Knight, similarly. Does no Tink. damage this time. <laughs> and, you know, same procedure. They're just lining up to die <laughs> at this point. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Do I have to? Yes, you have to. Pow! <laughs> Welcome to the life of armored units. We do this all the time. We just stand here and then people die against us. <laughs> yep. If they can get to you, stares at Mjolnir's Mjolnir zone. All right, my guardian knight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Do I even need to say it? <laughs> oh yeah. By the way, you guys get the chess key. It's in the convoy because you know Daphne got it. So now Lulietta, Daphne turns towards her sister. Here, catch. She tosses you the chess key. Thanks. Looks like there are some chests up uh, up north. I'm sure whatever's in them is useful. All right. Meanwhile, these knights are going to start advancing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Meanwhile, this guardian knight gonna come down. One, two, three, four, five, six. Attack Audrey. Alrighty. All right, so Audrey's defense. First of all, let's uh, see what we have to add to. Cool. Angelite's attack is fifty-four. All right, fifty-four. I'll do the calculations after I do the base damage. Okay, so Audrey defense fifty-two. Angelite defense fifty-two plus the Earth Bunker bonus. 
That's going to be six damage on Audrey. Taking him down to 51. In the meantime, Audrey's counterattack. Audrey has 46 attack. Triangle, no triangle advantage. Four plus Angel Eyes, and because she has the flame shortcut, I'll calculate the res. Uh, so four plus Angel Eyes is Four, you said? 54, yes, and you're very far away. Whoops. 54. Zero. Res is. 18. So that's going to be 12. All right, so 36 plus 4, 40 damage. All right. Uh, cool. And the Guardian Knight's speed is 27. Audrey's speed is 35. So he does this again. And the Guardian Knight goes down. In the meantime, let's get some experience points on Audrey. Alright, so, Audrey's level 19, the guy was level 40-something. 75 experience points. I don't have Audrey's sheet open. Let me get it open, then. Thank you. Uh, drive. Okay, stand by for a second while I grab this. All right, let's see. Yeah, it cheats. If my Google tra if my Google Drive could be a bit faster, that'd be nice. There we go. Audrey. Da, 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 da. That will be a level up. Yes. Off. Oh. <laughs> okay. Seventeen, and Audrey is now in the Mile High Club. Oh, hey, good for my brother, I guess. All right, let me just go ahead and calculate those stats. Right, so seventy-five, barely an increase in HP. Okay, 40, 47 attack. Defense is nineteen. Ten. So yeah, it's one point in defense. Forty-eight. Res. All right, a very good level up. A very very good level up. Speed. Forty-one. All right. Looks like that training paid off. All right. This guardian knight's gonna walk up to walk up to Mihal. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Are you sure you want to do that? <laughs> it's his only option. All right. And now he's going to die. <laughs> cool. All right. Miel's defense, please. 40. All right. 40. That's right, so going to be uh, with triangle disadvantage. Whoops. Nah. Nine damage. All right. And meanwhile, uh, Miel's attack. And what? 45. Okay, 45. What might is... Sabato is that not Windows? Eight. Eight. Okay. But it does have effective damage, so. Mm hmm. And triangle advantage. <laughs> 45 damage on the Guardian Knight. And because, you know, it's Mihel, he goes twice. Bam, bam. So. Whoosh, whoosh. The Gold Knight is going to attack our poor defenseless cleric. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Who apparently has abs of steel because Luna's defense is 47. Amazing. Alright. 12. It's going to be 15 damage on Luna. Okay. And that's it. 
And for Mihel's experience, let's see, level of Mihel. Mihel is level 21. Okay, so it's going to be 75 experience points for Mihel. Level up. Yay. That stung. Golden Knights going to advance. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And now all of these guys have armor march. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. <laughs> Alright, Mage Knight's going to come down. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6, 7, 8. And now, the Mafe Digs! 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And the Cantor raises his staff. To me, spirits of the night! And he summons two more Mafe Digs. Alright. That'll do it for the enemy phase. It is now ally phase. So, uh, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What, what damage can we be doing here? Uh, hey, that's a nice triangle disadvantage and uh, movement type you got there. It'd be a shame if I had Swift Sparrow 3 and a cavalry effective weapon. Anyways, bye! <laughs> Didn't mean to delete you. Delete you! <laughs> anyway, bye! And Edward leaped through the world. Well, bye, Edward! One more stone. <laughs> oh, God! I've peered into the abyss! What was it like? It was very, very dark. But it was also very, very white. And there was a grid! Oh, my God, I've <laughs> seen that grid in my nightmares! <laughs> I saw a vision of my dad, of my father. His face was covered by that grid. That sounds terrible. It was terrible. Because it was, first of all, it was my father. And second of all, I leaped through the void. Hmm. Anyways, well, maybe you should take your, maybe you should take your feelings out on these enemies. <laughs> well, I just did. Well, well, we got the one. That's the start. <laughs> yes. And I've got the other. Daphne picks. Daphne takes her sword, and then she just slams it down upon this dark bishop. And I don't think this guy's going to survive. <laughs> Will he survive? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, Daphne, fifty-eight attack plus her sixty might weapon. The mage's defense is bad. <laughs> Seventy-seven damage. Wow. You've little to worry about from him now. She sheathes her sword. All right, Latifa is gonna. I'm gonna check her skills really quickly. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oops, I did it again. Oh god, the internet crashed again. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. <sighs> well, I'm gonna keep on going with the uh keep on going with the enemy phase. So Latifa, let's see. What can I take advantage of? Well first of all, def defense opening three activates, so who amongst us has the highest defense? Luckily, we have a handy-dandy chart that can check that. Yes. Noah! Noah now has defense in the 70s! <laughs> so yeah, Noah now has 73 defense. Wow. Noah Second will not all, be killed. Noah cannot die. Noah will stay alive forever! Second of all, let's see. Roll attack res, attack res ruse. 
So what I am going to do is I'm going to one, two, three, four, five. I'm going to rally Folky's attack. And what's gonna happen is this guy, this guy, and this guy all get a penalty to their attack and res. Nice. So it's uh let me check the let me check the exact number. Alright, so it's gonna be attack res minus five on these on these three guys. So, in light of that, let's have Murr come up here and attack the Guardian Knight. Alright, so. Da, 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 da. I have the Murr builds. <laughs> so, attack is 52. And the res of the guy is uh, 18 minus 5 because of. Attack res ruse. Okay, that's gonna be 39 damage on the Guardian Knight. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Forgot the forgot the weapon effect. So let's see. Da, 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 da. So she is within. She is next to some allies. Yes. So this is so that is going to proc. Attack speed, defense res plus five. 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 Defense is uh, thirty-six. And then minus five attack. So she is going to take sixteen damage from the Guardian Knight. Okay, so that's gonna take her down to 29. And she makes a follow-up attack. So this guy's dead. Uh yeah. He sees all these guys to the right. And he's like, Those are mine! They have angered the knowledge keeper. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I cannot reach them. This angers the knowledge keeper. <laughs> Alright, Constantine. One, two, three, four, five, six. Just for the sake of activating Armor March. Kadho. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, Rigid is gonna accompany her liege off to the left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Esther. One, two, three, four, five, six. Mike. Mike is gonna sneak off somewhere. Scout ahead a bit. One, two, three, four, five, six. And Quartza. One, two, three, four, five. Hmm. Okay, they have deep wounds, so cannot heal them. So let's just heal Audrey back up to full. So Audrey is back up to full. Okay. Player phase. All right. Gale Force is ready, and I have Zambato. <laughs> ah, excellent. Is it killing My connection time? to the server, however, has been interrupted. Uh oh. Does the internet just hate us today here on Cursed Throne? Ah. Cursed. If it, 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 it just happened to me, too. So, like, maybe if something happened Wait, to the Oh, me, too. Okay, okay, it, okay it, I'm it, back. Message just disappeared. I'm back, I'm too. back, too. Cool. Okay. There was a burp, but thankfully nothing crashed. All righty. Bye. <laughs> uh, once, he, once he moves over that way, uh, Mihela will attack the mage tonight. Okay. It is time for bye. <laughs> bye. All right. Mage Cavalry, Res Defense, Mage Cavalry, your defense is 13. So, not great. That's an invalid number. 
Alright, so it's going to be a triangle disadvantage and effect weapon effectiveness. 56 damage. Twice, because, you know, Gale is fast. Yep. The Mage Knight goes down, and Gale Force procs. Gale Force is ready. Uh, I'm going to leave him here for right now while I figure out how best to clear out some of these armor units. Uh, the... Um, Folky could finish off the Dark Knight over here, but I would want to wait for Murr to move. I guess I can't. Murr is an ally. Murr is an ally. Murr attacked from this way. There was still an ally within two spaces, so there we go. <laughs> there we go. We did it, Reddit. We did it, Reddit. <laughs> we moved. All right. Hey. Now is now is killing time. Think I won't die. Yes, you probably won't die. <laughs> this guy, on the other hand, he's screwed. Yeah. Okay, so uh, let's see. Bulky attack thirty nine. Uh, ten plus your bonus from the rhythm skill. Thank you for the bit. Thank you for the bit, Sleepy. Thank you for the bit. Thank you, Sleepy. Which means that we do have to a draw a card and b bring in a cameo character. Yes. We'll wait for that one though for our uh, for our uh, additional players though because uh, people are coming in a little bit late. Mm -hmm. Yep. And we haven't seen a we haven't seen a Shiner cameo in a while. However, we can still draw the card, but let me just calculate this combat first. So, odd rhythm 2, it's going to be 4 to every stat, including attack. No apostrophe there, because that would screw up all of the calculations. Physical damage with... Alright, it's a neutral hit. That's going to be 40 damage twice in the Dark Knight. And he's down. <laughs> And I killed the formula, but that's okay. I'm, I can bring it back. back. And Fulky, deep wounds has worn off. Hooray! I can get healed now. Yes, you can get healed now. Give me my experience. Yes, your experience. Uh, let's see. So Fulky was level, definitely level low, lower level. So seventy-five. That's a level up. I just need to calculate. Hey, level up noise. There we go. <sighs> All right. Okay. In the meantime. Just doing some calculation in my head. Okay. And uprising, I saw you tapping the Lieta. Did you wanna did you wanna move her? Yeah, I was thinking about moving the Lieta. I was also thinking about um maybe Tristana healing Folky. Who needs the experience more? <laughs> we can check that with the handy baby chart. We sure can. Lieta. Lieta's lower level. <laughs> yes. And also she keeps dying. <laughs> so we should probably fix that it's not her fault she's squishy yeah her health is stored in her bazongas just like just like Maxine's yes but her bazongas are not protected you need bazonga armor mm -hmm. you, need, you, you gotta have the titty armor like Camilla for Fire Emblem yes Anyways, now that that now that that's done, we do need to draw the card. So, 
Uh, Uprising, why don't you draw the card? You're the you're the furthest one on the list. Yeah. It's, it's the, it's, it's the Republican. It's the Republican. It's the Republican. Oh no! Damn it! All right. The Publican. One of the game's bosses will become an ally to the players at some point. It may be a boss they fought or one they have yet to fight. Given how scripted like the boss encounters have been, though, like I might just ask you to draw another <laughs> the king becomes our ally <laughs> i just decided i had enough of these dragon cult hoes <laughs> <laughs> screw you screw the kingdom screw the dragon cult hoes all of you are my allies now all right the theater <laughs> all right let's see the theater the player must, in character, tell a spicy pickup line, and the audience gets to rate the pickup line out of six. If rating plus one d20 is greater than boss's res over four, the boss of the map cannot counterattack until the map is complete. Oh my god! Wow. <laughs> so, uh. stares at Fabio. It's time to die! Wait, All right, who... Uprising, hit us with that pickup line. Wait, which... It said the character gives a pickup line, so... All right, Uprising, give us a uh, little Yetta pickup line. Uh. Um. Take your time. Just <laughs> take your time. Yeah, I gotta think of one. I'm we, trying to we, make it Fire Emblem themed. Right. All right. Just let me know when you have your answer. <laughs> uh, hang on, I like have the idea. I'm just trying to put it into yeah, words. Just, just, no, no, no worries, no worries. We're just we're just pleading with bated breath. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the delivery right. is gonna be bad. Hit us. But... <laughs> Girl, you must be a blue unit because you're making me feel hot and red and you've got type effectiveness over me. <laughs> I had like the the idea of what I wanted to do, but I just had to put words to it. Mm, give that lunch to me. Uh. <laughs> All right, audience, rate it out of six. Let's get some ratings over here. Yeah, let's get some ratings. That's seven. That is a seven. <laughs> right, unfortunately, seven is unfortunately the rating is out of six, but I'll I'll, I'll count that as a six. <laughs> All right, so five. five. Piper, Six, four point five for the delivery. Five. Okay, so the uh. seems to be. So the average is five. So five plus one d twenty. So uh, uprising, please roll five plus one d twenty. Uh, how do I do that? It's been a really uh, long time since I've done that. Uh, slash r one d twenty plus five. In the meantime, let me check Fabio's res. It didn't recognize the command. I didn't recognize the command. That is rude of it. There we go. Nine. All right, so the res of Fabio is 29. So divide that by four. 29 divided by four. Seven. Seven. <laughs> okay, so Fab, so a mysterious energy wafts around Fabio. He looks around. What is this? Oh, he collapses to the ground. He's he's clutching his axe. Oh, I feel as though I have been weakened somehow. My vision is spinning. Fabio now has the flash condition for the rest of the map. He cannot counter. He cannot make a counterattack. 
Hey, brother, how would you rate that pickup line? I would rate it a six out of six. Oh, okay, thank you. Okay, now y'all are getting weird. I thought you were gonna give it a one. Listen. Okay, first of all, it's not weird because I'm gay. Second of all... <laughs> it's true. Second of all... Listen, I just wanted to make you feel good. <laughs> <laughs> Fabio, please, let me change your token status. There we go. Uh, let's, let's give the hyper-realistic blood eye because his eyes are bleeding. Mm-hmm. All right. Oh man, I'm so glad we got that one. That was uh, I, I, I've been waiting for this one. We still haven't gotten the Mountain Man though. Oh well. I thought I'm we did we get that. I'm glad we did not get the Mountain Man today. I, my voice cannot handle the Mountain Man today. Okay. Maybe someday we'll get the Mountain Man, and Alex will have the voice for the Mountain Man. All right. So, who's next? All right. Um, oh, all right. Lilietta's experience for healing. Yes. All right. So, uh, Fulky is level 17. Lilietta is level 18. So, Lilietta gets nine, 90 experience points. Na -na -na. You're right. No. Okay. Wow. In the meantime, while Uprising is calculating those stat boosts, Alex, do you want to make any other moves? Any additional moves? Uh, yes. Then we held good experience for killing the last guy. I... I don't think so. Okay, that would help. Yes. Wait, I didn't even... I, we didn't even actually heal Folky. She's still at the same health. Then heal Bulky! Then heal Bulky! <laughs> I don't know how! <laughs> Wait. Attack uh, over 2 plus 10! Shit, okay. Uh, Here, let me do it for you. 20? No, it's fine. I figured out it's 30. <laughs> She's up to pull. I just did it. Okay, there is a lot of things that were going on and. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright. Anyways, experience for Miel. Okay, Miel, level da, 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 22. Uh, 75. Cool, level up. This may Yay. change things. Okay. In the one game where you don't want to run on. Yeah. All right. Sigh. Okay. Run some counts. Oh no, uh, I was gonna have him attack the Holy Knight, but it would not be worth it. The fence is too dang high. Uh, curses. Right? And he just barely can't take out the Gold Knight either. Damn it. I mean, you have other units that you could make and offer support. I do. If, even in the form of, like, chip damage or... I'm doing... I'm doing some big brain plays. Alright, big brain plays. Let's, uh, let's wait for those to process first. Someone has to do them. Alright. Una, move one space down. Una has moved one space down. She can do the rest of her turn later. Try and attack Prox. This will kill the Gold Knight if I sign bottom. Okay. So, yeah. It is time for Big Brain. Big Brain, please! Alright, let's go. Alright, so you still gotta calculate the damage on... It's gonna be dealt to... Behel. 
So that's gonna be 4, 2, 50, 12. 20 damage to me, hell. Doable. Small, small sacrifice, but, uh, you know. Then, uh, Mihel counterattacks, or no, follow up attacks. The Gold Knight goes down. Alright. And now. You look like you could use some healing. Heals. Not quite yet. <laughs> oh, not yet. Let me let me figure some stuff out first. Okay. Uh so four four tipsy step. Would Mihel be able to drink a Volinary after doing an attack, or is that his turn? Uh, let me check the skill. Tipsy step. Before taking turn in action, he's dead. Uh, no, it's, it's more like Kato. Okay, so never mind that. Just using the move. Alright. Uh, in that case... Nazera, I think you're safe to take out the bottom Baron. Now? Yes. One more space. I guess, <laughs> I guess the breath doesn't... Uh... It'll blow him into his buddy. Alright. Uh, got to attack him here, though. <laughs> There we go. Uh, okay, so attack res solo procs. So this is going to be a bonus of six. Uh, of course, there's the guaranteed follow up attack. Attack is 51. One of the might is. Da, 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 da. Check. 10. Breath. 10. Thank you. Might 10. Da, da, da. Resistance of the armor 13. is 13. Not great. <laughs> And there's what we're trying to advantage. He's 67... 67 damage on the Baron for the first hit. Taking it down to... Oh, hang on. There, there was the... There was the whole... Ward armor. 61 damage on the gold, on the Baron. Excuse me. Taking him down to 11. Baron counterattacks. And Queen's back. Hopefully the internet stays on this time. For how All long? Right. I don't fucking... <sighs> Anyways, uh... Let's see. Where, what am I looking at? <laughs> Armor I promoted, 53 attack, 12 might weapon. Uh, defense of Nizera is 41. So that's going to be 15 damage on Nizera. And then Nizera makes a follow-up attack, destroying the Baron. And the Baron is down. Nizera, you gain... Uh, 20, uh, 75 experience points. And no, no. Okay. <laughs> no, no, no. Looks like my training paid off. <laughs> I big brained it. I big brained it. All right. Go ahead and heal Mihel. All right. Mihel, you are now healed. Cool. Up to full because Una is God. <laughs> Alright. Uh now da, da, da. Let's have a replica of any, uh reposition Una. Alright. Una has been moved. Experience. Right. Uh experience for Una. Uh da, da, da. 
Who uh, knows her priorities? Did you get any? Did you get anything whilst I was gone? Uh, nope. Uh, no. All right, so twenty-eight level twenty-eight versus level uh, twenty-three. Fifty experience points. Level up. Yes. She grows stronger with every <laughs> heal. <laughs> Okay. And you got to put so... the uh, the macho clothes on, no, not yet. <laughs> In <middle>. Yeah. <laughs> Una, I would appreciate it if you healed Nizera again. So Leon is gonna dance you. Okay. Okay. This does change things. So. Oh. Oh. What is it? Uh. Okay. So. Big brain play was. I'm going to see if Angel Eyes can take out the Fortress Knight. Okay. Oh, I see. The other thing is that Una, Una already has the other turn built in, so like, no, no need to dance currently. Oh, no. I see. But I want all the turns. <laughs> Looks like my training paid off, because I level up in everything but speed. All right. Angel Eyes versus the Fortress Knight. All right. Let's see. Uh, it doesn't have any skills that affect himself. He's more of a, he's more of a battery for these four guys. So once you take that out, you're good. <laughs> All right, so zero bonuses. I don't think Angel Eyes has any bonuses there either. So Angel Eyes, attack, please. Angel Eyes, attack of, come on. Angel Eyes, attack, 54. 54, okay. Weapon Might. Weapon Might is Flame Shuriken, Might of seven. Seven, okay. And that's going to be a magical hit. We got bits. Ooh, did we get more bits? More bits? Ah. I see. Thank you. I see. We'll have to... All right. Well, first of all... All right, so... Uh... First of all, let's finish this combat, and then we'll draw the card. And then okay. we'll also <laughs> introduce the cameo character. All right, Wait, so we have 48... two cameo characters now. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, it's Scott. Hello. Hello. Right. I'm in the middle of a big brain play, so I used some Phineas. I hope you don't mind. I do not mind. Oh, also, important for Phineas, uh, boobies uh, died. <laughs> not re for real, but... I've been told. I am okay. not happy, but she's not dead, right? No, nope. she's not no, dead. She's she, fine. she retreated. She, she, had, okay. she fell here. She can't fall here, so she <laughs> had to make her Very retreat. good. I am signing in. <laughs> All right. So first, okay. Two hits a forty-eight. That's going to kill the fortress knight. Destroy. <laughs> Bam. Goodbye, armor march and stat bonuses. <laughs> <laughs> no more stat bonuses for you. <laughs> okay. Let's see. All right. Angel eyes level twenty-three. These guys level twenty-four. So seventy-five experience points. Nice. That All right. is a level up. Excellent. Almost at level and 14. now, a sigil appears. Uh, let's see, let's see. Where should I put this character? So our last, our last cameo was lean. So that means, down if we're going down the line here, it is time for Loki. <laughs> uh, okay, which side has this healers? Fear healers. Uh, which side? Hey, what's Loki up? Has... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, who- Oh, Jesus Christ, get away from me. Yeah, what no, I, I'm not Jesus. Yeah, I, I predate Jesus is the problem here, so. <laughs> okay, what's, what's your name? Jesus. Loki. <laughs> Who's Jesus? Oh, Loki, get away from me, ugh. I mean, I can make that happen. I can warp you to the other side of the planet. No, please. Well, maybe later. Yeah. Anyway, this makes Big Brain Play a whole lot more viable, so you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I'm sure you've assessed the situation, given that you uh, are talking about Big Brain Plays. Yeah, more or less. And we have to draw the card, so Alex, please draw a card. Alrighty. I'm actually hoping it's not the Mountain Man, because I don't want to kill your voice. <laughs> 
It is not. It is the keep. The keep. Okay, Cow's let's see. Castle baby. What does the keep do? Da, 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 da. Makes my tits huge. But sure we wish. already did that. <laughs> Honey, true. you don't need any help from me. <laughs> One of the player's units is locked in a 3x3 three three cell that appears in a random location on the map. One of the random uh, enemies is given the cell key. Damn it! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh, oh no! no. Mm. I'm gonna this roll is the terrible for this map! I'm gonna roll the die! <laughs> It's that okay, like Una's rescue. It's okay, Una's rescue. <laughs> Una had to rescue. This is only a minor inconvenience, thankfully. Why did I roll four of those? No. Okay, two. Let me go to the calculator. Uh, Angel Eyes is warped to a random location. <laughs> See y'all, oh, boy. Insult injury. <laughs> Just to add insult to fucking injury. Alright, where is Angel Eyes? There she is. Uh, it yep. gets her out of the... It gets her out of the danger zone! <laughs> it gets her out of the danger zone! That actually saves us some time from rescuing <laughs> Angel Eyes this turn. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. And Angel Eyes is in the cell. I'm in jail for war crimes. No. Finally. A magical cell appears around Angel Eyes. A bar the barrier appears to be unlocked with a magical key. And the key is in the hands of... Oh. Oh, come on! <laughs> Wait, that thing has hands? Yes, it has hands. <laughs> oh. <laughs> mm. Why has this... it gotta be so far away? This makes me uncomfortable. Makes you uncomfortable. Really, it makes you uncomfortable. What's that? I can't <laughs> hear you. You're so far away. Hold on, let me get out my megaphone real quick. <laughs> Angel Eyes pulls out a bullhorn. I am actually looking for a megaphone here, voice man. Oh no. <laughs> really? Really makes you uncomfortable? <laughs> <laughs> what? Where did you get that? I found it. <laughs> you know, the castle is really full of mysteries. Anyway, this actually works out super well. Just, just like, use the rescue staff on the later. Less talking, more fighting. I mean, please would be nice. Silence. Total silence. <laughs> Total silence. <laughs> This actually works out pretty well because Angel Eyes can start killing guys over there. Mm-hmm. Where uh, is she? Uh, up top in the snow. They can't get her because she's in the cell. Oh. oh they can't beautiful. get her because she's in jail, but she can get them because she's a ranged unit. Mm -hmm. Oh, true. Oh, All right. Why did she? Why, did, she I, why did I go here? This she is, is not. Stayed. This is not my jail cell. <laughs> this is not my beautiful house. This is not my beautiful wife. <laughs> Where's Lilietta over there? But you don't have a wife. Why is Lieta over there? What Why is Lieta over there? Ah! <laughs> uh, oh my God! Well, Lieta, I didn't know you knew duplicate too. You're also I, not I my didn't... beautiful. You're also not my beautiful wife. <laughs> I could have been. Why are there two What? <laughs> There's two Lietas. Oh my God! <laughs> Roll twenty is a functional program. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We still in player phase. Yes, we're still in player phase. Um, right. okay. I will but we'll move up and spray Constantine. Okay. And then one, two, three, four. Now I can move nine spaces! <laughs> Am I cool to take out this gold knight here? <coughs> Let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You're just out of range. I'm out of range? Yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because... You're a dick and don't do diagonal stuff. I get it. <laughs> yeah. Get That's used not... to it. Shit. Judo's not a dick. That's just how the game works. Yeah. <laughs> well, technically, right, then... I, wrote, I wrote the system, so. <laughs> cool. Right. Then I won't do anything. All right. Uh, hold, hold off for now. 
Um, but anyways, yeah, Constantine, Kako, Noah, Lean, and uh, Folky all have a, and uh, Latifa all have plus two to their movement. Folky already killed someone. Yeah, Folky already killed someone. <laughs> it gives Noah nine movement. It does give Noah nine movement. Stairs at Mage Knight. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking about it. <laughs> Chunk. No, wait. Cle oh, okay. Denza. That's as far as he can move. He's got seven. Oh, I see. Okay. Clank. 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 Oh, you're approaching me. Remember, you can't counterattack. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. <coughs> yeah, you're right. I c Actually, wait. What is the Mage Knight's defense? Bad. <laughs> Thirteen. What do I do with a fucking shock stick? All right, let's see what we have here. Uh, no, no, definitely no. All right, I think I'm going to go with... Hmm. And its HP is currently... HP? 52 currently, out of 64. Can you give me an exact number on its defense? Uh, let's see. Da -da -da -da. Cavalry Mage. 13. 13. Oh, wait. None of this matters because I have Ignis ready. It is time for the bigness. bigness. All right, so that's 51 attack. That's 61 defense. And I'm going to use a Brave Lance just in case. Okay, well, nope. This guy's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Takes Lamp. That does it. Unmages your knight. <laughs> <laughs> no, you take your Lance. It feels... It feels swift in your hands, and you jab the, the you jab the mage knight twice. Spark this ain't fly. my shock. This ain't my shock stick. Ah oh, well, stab. And the mage knight goes down. <laughs> All right, experience. Uh, let's see. All right, Noah is Noah is level twenty-seven. Okay, twenty-seven. Uh, sixty experience points. Sixty. All right. Two support points away from C rank bro support with me on here. Nice. All right. And after this player phase, we'll go on break because uh, we're it's about halfway. We're about half time. All right. Um. Other than that. So you moved. Which of my boys you moved? You moved regular Phineas, you moved Audrey, you moved uh, Charles. Okay, so the duped the replicates yeah. the last two. I think I think I figured out the rest of the big brain play. Alright. Okay. Alex, what's the rest of the big brain play? Alright. So. Uh da, da, da. Wait, give me sorry. No, I have to do some more math. No worries. Lovely weather we're having. It's Lovely snowing. weather we are having, it's yes. It's snowing. It's snowing. It is. Oh. Yeah, it <laughs> is! <laughs> Alright. Uh, how confident are you in uh, in Audrey's chances against the Holy Knight if he engages right now? Let's see. Audrey has... Hmm. Audrey currently has 48 defense, 46 resistance. If I equip him with the beast rune, then that'll be plus two to those stats. Um, oh, but he's ended his turn already, so I can't do that. No, he hasn't. Oh, he hasn't? We forgot to take up. We haven't taken off the thing yet. We oh, him yeah. Okay. Um, We've been are you... lazy about that. I see. Okay, so are you talking about initiating combat? Initiating combat. I see. Okay. And remind me, Juno, um, item consumption is a bonus action, in a manner of speaking? Uh, no, it's a, it's a primary action. Primary action. Okay. Secondary action, primary. All right. Um, can you just give me the defensive stats of the Holy Knight? Yes. Uh, let's see. Holy, Holy Knight. 50 defense. 50 defense. Yeah. And, uh, 18 res. 
So the thing about Audrey is that he un- he is the Kane archetype. In other words, his attack is not that great compared to his defenses. All right. So, do you not want to attack? He has 47 attack. In that case, move one space up and end your turn. <laughs> Sounds good. I move one space up. Yep, that All is right. plus f- that activates Earth Bunker. That is plus five to his defense. Now, Phineas, would you like to reposition Audrey? Sounds good. You, Leon, would you like to dance Phineas? <laughs> Sounds good. All right, Leon, so you twerk for Phineas. Plus six, and that also gives you experience points. So hang on, uh, Leon. Da, 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 level 22, Phineas, level 21. 90 experience points. Nice. And, uh, and uh, with attack speed link, <clears throat> that will bring Audrey to, let's see, wait for 9, 53 attack and 42 speed. Yeah. Uh, so we got another free reposition and free turn in, plus Phineas still has an attack, so there's that. Phineas, mm-hmm. would you like to reposition to Zara? Uh, which direction? Uh, I would prefer from the right. That would keep you the safest. From the right. Wait, here? Yeah, That's gonna can... keep him the safest? Well, the idea is that Nazera and Phineas are gonna go take out two more barons. If this Phineas repositions Nazera, then he can't move anymore. He can't? I thought because Leon he, gave him another he, turn. It, he's repositioned once already. If he repositions a second time, that ends his turn. Okay. Unfortunately, he cannot do it an infinite amount of times. Okay, okay, okay. That does change things. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> he can reposition Nazera and give her that second turn, but then he will be... That, that yeah. would not be safe. <laughs> yeah. I can put Audrey back, and we can reconsider from there. My big brain play has failed. <laughs> It's okay. Oh no. Oh no. Should we uh, revert our previous move? Yeah, if you, if you want, you can do that. All right. So All I believe right. put everybody over back. Here. Put your put your game pieces back. <laughs> I mean, you too, Leon. Hell. <laughs> it's all right. It's all right, it's all right. <laughs> I wish I could have infinite repositions, but alas, I cannot. But alas, game balance is kind of a thing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait, here's one idea. Hmm? Trixie, fly over there normally. All right, Trixie flies over here normally. Throw rocks at this man. <laughs> <laughs> How will that help? I'll find it hilarious. <laughs> all right, it is time to... Oh, right, hang on. Magic Ranger. <laughs> Match race must be. Yes. All right. It is time to throw some rocks. <laughs> I, I actually didn't I we give. Rock. Didn't we give uh, Trixie a new weapon? I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. I have the convoy. Uh, she had. Yeah. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce this one, but it's a savage tome. No, poison yeah. tome. Sorry. Oh, wait, that's uh, right. Yonder. Uh, after com- yes, after combat, if unit attack deals eight damage to target. All right. Let me put that in. Let me actually put that in her sheet as well. That would help. Because mm-hmm. you know, yeah. has a might of ten. If that also helps. Yes, that that, that does help. <laughs> Heck, yeah. Right. Oh, th- uh, thank you for putting in the things while I was getting a <laughs> Trix- uh, Trixie sheet. So what's the damage? Uh, it has a might of 10. Alright. So, Trixie definitely doubled this guy. Uh, she's gonna take him out with 52 damage, 2 hits. Okay. Pow, pow! A snake made of rocks bursts from the ground, grabs the Holy Knight, and drags him and crushes him. He's, he's, he's dead. He's dead. Nice. 
Alright, so that takes care of the Holy Knight. Hello? Hello, yes. yes. Yep. Holy Knight's dead. Okay. Alright, so that's one problem taken care of. Um, I'm assuming the Barons only have silver weapons. Yes, that's correct. Okay, good, good. good. Hmm. All right. Uh... Well, if you need some time to think of a big brain play, we are we are about half. We are a little bit over. Yeah, give so. give me give yeah. me some time to think of a big brain play because I also need the bathroom. Yes. That would be good. So we'll see you all. We we'll see you on about ten minutes, ten to fifteen minutes. All right. Hopefully, my big brain will be working by then. Bye bye. Yes. Great. All right. Bye. <laughs> all right. Welcome back to Cursed Throne. First of all, because hello everybody, Shiner's here. Yo. We also hold holy shit. Hold where did you come from? Holla at your mom. That's where. All right, came from so my mom. All, I came since, from my mom. Uh, since Shiner hasn't been here for a while, we held off on the first cameo character. So now it's time to plop Snickers back in prey. Oh god, this little thing, this little, this, <laughs> this little cool morsel character. of a thing. <laughs> okay. Snickers is plopped right into the right there. Oh. Uh, shit, not. Here again! Ugh! She fucking... <laughs> she looks around and she's like, Oh god! You people! Let me out! Can't Please do, don't won't do. scream at me. Not exactly gonna... capable of that at the moment anyhow. I'm gonna eat you next! Please don't? Maybe? Good idea? Yeah? Cool! Okay, we're in agreement! <laughs> Your name tab says Snickers, and for some reason I feel like you really satisfy, really, really, so... Oh, <laughs> that's really creepy! Thanks for thinking about that! <laughs> I'm just gonna sidestep Welcome. over this way! <laughs> <laughs> you sidestep, there's a giant owl behind you. Ah! I am the Knowledge Keeper! Where does you come from, little one? <laughs> Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm surrounded by freaks! You get used to it. Yeah, I don't think I want to! Uh, send me back! Mm, not an option right now. Right now we got to kill, like, basically everyone in this castle, and then probably you'll go to, get to go home. I don't know, that's how these things usually work. <laughs> oh, this. This again. All right, fine. Let's do moiter time, I guess. All right, it is now murder time. <laughs> it is now murder time. All right, so Alex, have you figured out the the rest of the play? I have figured out the rest of the big brain play. Hey. Brain play. All righty. So, Charles, you have the cleave bow, and that's effective against armor, yes? He does have the cleave bow, which is effective against armor, yes. Do you need me to move me hell or anyone to help set up uh, attack speed bonus shenanigans for you? Let me see. Uh, attack speed bond, he just needs to be next to an ally. In order to get the most out of attack speed form, he needs to be within two spaces of three or more allies. So do what you will with that information. Oops. Fair enough. <laughs> um, let's see. I'm trying to figure out where to place him. Because plus five is not a bad bonus by any stretch of the imagination. Um, the Baron's defense is... Thick. Is large. I don't have... Yes. The, the, the specific number precise. is, uh, 55. 
All right, so 48 plus, hold on, 48 plus five, if there are two allies within two spaces. So 49, 50, 50, 50, 53, plus attack speed bond is plus six, 59 times, I think, 1.5? Yeah, there's a calculator here. I can, I can just punch in all the numbers. So 59 okay, times 1.5, that's 88 times two. So it would do that much damn. It would do a sizable Again. chunk. Yes. And that is with disadvantage as well, but... Yeah. Oh, but he does have Matchmaker, so and I'm pretty confident he has a decent amount of supports at this point. Decent. Alright, Charles has supports with... Uh, he doesn't have a support with Mihal. He's got a support with Audrey. Excellent. Okay, hey, I, if he doesn't take out the Baron, I think he's going to do a heck of a lot of damage to it. Alright, let's do this. So, Charles' attack is... as Well, we already established that. Charles' attack is 48, uh, plus 5, plus 6, and the might of the cleave bow is 10. Alright, Baron's defense is 55. Uh... I do he's gonna double. <laughs> yeah. All right, so that's gonna do thirty damage for for per hit. So it's gonna be one, two, taking him down to twelve health. Nice. Very close to dying. Okay. And in terms of experience, you get up to two. Nineteen. Nineteen. Okay. All right. The next part of the big brain play, the risk I'm going to take could be calculated, or we could see if Audrey can do anything to this Baron. Um, All right. Hmm. What are your options here? All right, so my options are either Audrey kills the Baron, or we send in Mitzi and hope she can do 12 damage in a hit. I mean, Lady Blade. <laughs> I mean, Lady Blade. Do flat, she does do flat damage. Yes. Yeah. I mean, I... I st sh sure? Well, let me calculate it first. I, we if, if we, we gotta calculate it first so yeah, that you no, don't no, get no, body yeah, we gotta calculate. Yeah. yeah. Because yeah. I, don't, I don't want Mitzi to jump in and then get, uh, jump in and then get bodied. Uh, okay, so no, she, yeah, she, yeah. Very high attack, so it's very possible for her to do this. Have any, have any of her skills proc at this point? Uh... No, I gotta think of through and stew and brew. Oh, Wait, one. actually... 47 attack plus... That didn't proc yet, so... Uh, 54, 55. 55 so minus 50. Yeah, it, yeah, if... 3 plus attacked, 7, attacked, oh, only do 10 damage. If Audrey yeah. attacks, it would only do 10 damage. And Mitzi only does 10 damage as well. Yike. Oh, wait. So, wait. Oh, wait, oh. but if Audrey has a support with someone, then... Yeah, he's got support with Charles. Is it a B rank? Uh, it is a C rank. However, we're also factoring in triangle advantage. Oh, wait, he's got support that with is Charles true. and Mihel. That is true. So, he might Audrey, finish pick it. Him up. All right. Okay. The tiger gets it. All right. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> and we saved Mitzi from getting bodied by the Baron. Nice. Uh, hell yeah. There are still two Barons. There are still two Barons, yes. <laughs> um, Audrey's level is 20. Alright, level 20. 19 experience points. Not to, Sorry, sorry. 75 Whoa. experience points. 75. That is... Ah, uh, oh, so close. Almost. Uh, so uh, close. Uh. <laughs> All right. Eat off. Now let's big brain the rest of these guys. Phineas, reposition the Zara. Oh, by the All way, right. we should where have we, the chest key. Where are we dropping, boys? Uh, anywhere. Let's put right there, so Phineas can also get that uh that sexy sexy anathema three. Cool. All right. Has is there? 
And she also gets uh, attack speed plus six. Cool. Attack speed plus six. The uh, defense bonuses on the barons are no, gone, wait, I attack think. Speed. Actually, wait. Hang on. Did I... No, plus four. My bad. So, attack bonus. I think the defensive bonuses on the barons are gone. Uh... Mm -hmm. I think she should be able to get them one shot. Possibly. Either way, she'll be okay. Okay. So... So, Nizera, attack 52, right with my to 10. And then, uh, no solo bonus this time, but uh, she's definitely faster than this guy. Alright, armor unit, 13 res. But she does have the bonus from attack speed link, so that's going to take her up. That's going to be 68 damage. Nizera, hold on. So. Here's my idea, then. Before Nadera does that. Hang on. Uh, minus three. 71 damage. Yeah, because of anathema. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's almost enough. It's one hit point. That's so frustrating. Okay, so, can we hold off on that for a second, then? Okay. Yeah. That. I'm gonna fly over here. Warp Leon over to Phineas. Dance Phineas. <laughs> yeah. I see where this is going. So okay. you can back away from this era and take out the other Baron. There we yes. go. Alright, so Leon has been warped. Dance Phineas. Alright, you have twerk for Phineas. Uh, let's get your experience points. Oh no, I, the, I should be the same as what it was before, so. When you gave it to me. And then I leveled yeah. up. Uh. <laughs> Hello? Hello. Uh. Sorry, we're mapping. No, I was wondering if that was still happening or not. Yeah, move, move finish. <laughs> Alright. Uh, uh, I will have him walk himself right here next to Audrey so that he can get some benefits from Gron Owl. Um, so that is... Plus two, yes. Okay. So that. Uh oh. Who did we lose? Oh, that's Queen. That's Queen. I oh, think shit. that's just gonna. Yeah. Alright. Um, anyways, so <clears throat> that is plus two to all of his stats, except for attack and speed, because he already has the plus four. Um, so. No, wait, that's a combat buff. Ignore me. Um, alright, so. Attack is 45, um, Gron Owl's Might is 9, and that's a buff of 6 to attack, 6 to speed, and I don't think it'll come into effect at all, but if you need it, then plus 2 to defense and resistance as well. Uh, Juno, right, you're quiet. Huh? Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. And of course, with take... Anathema 3, that's uh, 6 um, resistance off of the Baron. Oh, right. 6. And that hit would have killed Desire anyway, but you know, getting rid of more Barons is always nice. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Desire would have gotten rid of it anyway, if that's the case, but you know. What? Well. Okay, so I'm fairly sure that I don't need to, cal I don't need to, I don't need to calc Phineas killing the Baron, so. <laughs> Alright, you're dead. So, just you're dead. throws out a shit ton of out. Yep, there we go. Bear yeah. Crisis averted. Commence the Crisis. owl! Commence the owl! <gasps> the, knowledge... <gasps> the knowledge keeper looks over. I'm so proud. This instills pride within the knowledge keeper. Alright, so uh, let's calculate both his... Yeah, since Nazera was the one to first attack, um, calculate her first. Okay, 21, 24, 75. And then Phineas, Phineas is level 21. 21, also 75. Alrighty. Nice. 
And because Una still hasn't moved, she can heal Nazera back up to full. Alright, Nazera, you're back up to full. Yay! He's back to full. And Una should also be up to, uh, back up to full because of live to serve, I think. Nice. Yes. I'm assuming the regular Phineas has used up his turn already. Is oh, huh? uh, uh, no, no, he has not. Oh, well then. I keep forgetting that you guys just were were lazy with it. No, nothing yep. against you, but you guys were just lazy with the yeah. Yeah, we're just okay. lazy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I guess I'll just place him somewhere where the other unit, other enemies, won't be able to kill him. So. Oh yeah, um, Meowner is attacking that guy. Okay. Uh... Yeah, I'll wait for you to do that then. Yeah. All right. Ether is yeah, ready. Yeah. I don't think we have to calculate anything. No, we don't. Goodbye. <laughs> Heal the night. <laughs> also irrelevant to anything, but I'm looking at uh, the position of Bo and the Knowledge Keeper, and uh, just because of their names overlapping one another, it's like, be the Knowledge Keeper. <laughs> <laughs> Be the knowledge keep you wish to see in the world. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Scott, were you moving Phineas now? Uh, well, take care of me on here first. We did. Oh, right, experience uh, as well. Experience. Yeah. Uh, very important. Twenty-three, seventy-five. Well, up. Cool. All right. Um, is there anyone who would benefit from moving uh, anywhere in particular, or should I just have him get somewhere else? Um, we could probably benefit from taking out that last straggler gold knight. Yeah, Denzel could probably do it. Two, three, four, Easily. five, six, seven, eight. And that'll keep him safe. That'll, he'll still be safe from, like, I think the other... Denzel has the magic staff, right? Yes. He does. Okay, in that case, let's move him down here. Okay. He should be able to, because that's a range of three he'll have. So. Uh, no, it'll have to be back at range one. I'm not smart. Um, in that case... Oh, wait, but Phineas hasn't moved yet. He can reposition one more time. And I think... You are... Denzel can still move up there, regardless. Oh, uh, okay. Duo unit has one less movement, I think. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. That's all right. That's all right. They'll do it. Yeah, we and... still have that extra... Wiggle him back up there. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. All right, so I, I think do I enjoy have... wiggling. You? All right, you are wiggled. I know you, Sir Reinhardt. <laughs> All right. It listens, the Reinhardt. I don't do calculus. <laughs> okay, it counts. Yeah. Lightning crashes down upon the Gold Knight. The Gold Knight is dead. Nothing, nothing can stop the Reinhardt. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, all right. So, let's see. Uh, I'm all, just gonna okay, get this seven. out of the way, just so I can benefit from uh, Armor March once more. I'm just gonna use the remaining one to put Noah back down here. All right. Anyways. Okay. Uh, that's gonna be sixty experience. All right. Thank you. And I believe we're safe. The... <laughs> yes, we're safe. As for the rest, uh, Tristana needs to move. Mitzi needs to move. Snickers needs to move. I think Lee needs to move. And that's it. Yeah, Lee needs. Oh, uh, if you can't think of anything to do, you can just advance. Advance! Let's advance! 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 advance. Enhance! Huh. Move in an upwards direction! Oh, that, that. I gotta oh, split all of them. How far can I advance again? Uh, six spaces. Six! 
Six if you're an infantry, seven if you're a flyer. Oh, okay. One. Oh, nope. We've updated the uh, Snickers BST, right? I did, yes. Okay, good. <laughs> We're not going to lose her in one hit. I don't think there's anything that can reach Snickers. That'll... Yeah, not... Oh, the, okay. the Holy Knight can reach the, Snickers, but, you know... Bring, bring Trixie back down. We already moved Trixie. I was just too lazy to put a dot on. Oh, no. Oh, no. What did I do? Why did I move her up? Go back. All Holy right. Night, Trixie. He's going back. All right. Turn this car around. All right. Okay. In this case, then... All right. So... I know, I'm sorry, I'm counting. It's okay. <clears throat> it's okay, it's okay. Patience is a virtue, my friend. Uh, and did you move your sign yet? No, I'm debating. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's it's okay. No, 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 it's okay. No. To be fair, oh, oh, to be honest though, like uh, most of the area that Sh Tristana can move in is safe because there are no mm -hmm. enemies that can reach her. True. All right. And I don't so have to move to the safe. full seven, right? Or do you I have yeah, to? Yeah, but you but you're you safe if you, you're regardless of whether or not you whether or not you use the full seven, you are still safe no matter where you go with the full seven. So don't worry. Yeah, <laughs> you you literally can move anywhere between zero to seven spaces. All right. Well, she's going right there. Hiya. All right. <laughs> All right good. This will also give her a chance to proc her special uh, ability, uh, mm -hmm. special skill. Alright, so that means it is now enemy phase. Enema phase! Wait, Lean didn't go. <laughs> oh, Lean didn't go. Lean go. Uh, where- should she dance anyone? Oh? Uh... Maybe we could move the Mianer zone? Uh, none no, of them can reach us right <laughs> now, so... <laughs> also, Noah would be like, I just got here! <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> In that case, she'll just advance. Okay. <laughs> right. okay. Also, very important, is it an odd or even number turn? Uh, it is currently an odd number turn. Okay. Alright, so. Fabio shouts out to the other. shouts out to the others. Where are those damn enforcements? We're expecting more... We were expecting more fight from our own forces, and yet they're cleaning us. They're cleaning us out as if we are mere children. You hear footsteps as more soldiers pour into the castle, pour into the castle walls, ready ah. to attack. Uh, don't they stop? Uh, yeah. CC. Hup, 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 hup. Ah. Oh no! They'll reach us in three turns! <laughs> <clears throat> After that, they will enact their revenge. <laughs> However, as they do, you hear the loud cry of a whale. <clears throat> as the castle wall crashes open. A big old orca just <clears throat> crouches, bursts right in. Let me grab Captain Dorcas real quick. You fool! You spoiled who it was. <laughs> who else? Have, have we seen any other orca in this? Game? Yeah, yeah, but yeah, 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 Musham. Yeah, Musham. Surprise, motherfucker! Jordan's joining the game. <laughs> I really uh, like Fire Emblem. <laughs> the, orca the orca beats down the reinforcements, taking him out one by one with his great orca powers. And he turns to the others. Ah, sorry I'm late. But the cavalry's here. Stanley I... follows him through the hole in the wall. <laughs> uh, Captain, none of us have uh, horses. It's an expression, Stanley. 
Just go with it. I've got a horse. Does that count? <clears throat> of course that counts, but, uh, you know, none of, none of me crew have horses, so... However, we have brought along the full force of the, of the sea dragons with us. Uh, hopefully... Does that uh, hopefully mean... Hopefully Triton did get the message and we'll be coming in from the west at some point. However, <laughs> that is not the case. We'll fight by your side once again. Good to be back! Captain Dorcas I... notices that the air is slightly tense. <laughs> Did something happen to you? Yes. The mass woman think... unmasked herself and then everyone was very angry. Yeah, yes, that. Uh, I don't think that's the time to explain right the second. Of course. I gave the short version. I appreciate it, Denzel, but even so... <laughs> What, are you saying we should just leave him in the dark when it's very obvious there's a problem? No, 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 no. So does that, I, I'm just saying that if we do continue to explain this, we could be attacked at any moment, which is kind of what's happening now. In the meantime, sea dragons are are pouring in oh. from the eastern hole. They're, oh, they're okay, on your side, don't mind. worry. They have, they, have the, they have the green dots. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> they're green units. They're green units. The uh, dragons. Blubby. The Dagons. <laughs> Dagons. Dragon with no R. I kind of just look at the knowledge keeper, just like, I, I really thought I'd seen it all with you, but this is just... <laughs> Are you saying you have not seen the sea dragons? <laughs> I... It's been a little while, and by a little while, I think, like, a week. <laughs> uh, Charles raises up, his, raises up his bow and says, In any case, Sir Bow is correct. The sooner we clear the path, the better off we'll be. To arms! Right, mateys. Again, we fight by your side. And hopefully Triton will once he gets here. Did you bring cannons? As a matter of fact... <gasps> 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 and Captain Dorcas... Bring him on it! Bring him! Bring it on in! <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my god! <laughs> This changes everything. You did. <laughs> oh my god, Ellen, you didn't. <laughs> you get a cannon, and you get a cannon, oh everyone god. gets a cannon. <laughs> Actually, only one person gets the cannon, because we can only fit one, but... My cap... But it still stands. <laughs> <laughs> and they wheel a cannon into the castle. <laughs> one of the, Noah one looks of the at the cannon. wheels a cannon into the castle. The cannon is now ready for use. Noah oh, looks at the cannon, looks at the army. I nominate Una. Anyone want to second that? You have given Lady Una too much power. In fact, let's put another one over there. We brought two. Oh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> None of you are safe. <laughs> Captain... Stanley Stanley Cup walks over to Una and wheels it over, wheels the cannon over to Una's side, and he says, uh, "Miss Una, I understand that you uh, are very fond of these. Let me mount it. I could have worded that differently, but here you go. He the <laughs> cannon over to where Una can reach it. Oh, can I go now? Uh, no, because it is now enemy face. <laughs> You can, can, you you can reach it on foot. <laughs> can you move it a little bit closer? You can Get in some cardio, foot. Una. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so first of all, moving up to Angel Eyes. This <laughs> ranger is going to come up and attack her. A, a poor decision, really. <laughs> yes, it's a very poor decision. Alright. Angel Eyes, defense, 42. She has the Seed Shield seal, so it's a flat minus 10 damage from the Ranger. Alright. In the meantime, Ranger's stats. Uh, let me grab those. Ranger, 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 Ranger. 65. Uh, 50 attack. 50 attack. Okay, so 15. 10. That's gonna be 6 damage, minus 10. Ting! Angel Eyes' attack, please. Angel Eyes, attack of 55. 55. Uh, flame Shuriken? Flame Shuriken. 
All right. Lane for uh, a kid. Uh, let's see. Res for the Ranger. That's going to be 26. Yeah. All right. That's going to be. Good no trying to advantage. 12. Not a problem. It will posture you because I'll mess everything up. 36 damage on the on the ranger and because angel eyes is almost certainly faster yeah uh, 60 speed yes almost definitely faster this ranger effectively just looks at looks at angel tries to shoot her with the bow and she goes yeah. all right so the ranger shoots into your into your magical cell however now however angel as you hold up your shield the arrow bounces off, and you fling the flame shuriken twice at the at the ranger. The ranger dies. <laughs> All right, and I see there's another ranger. <laughs> this ranger is smarter than his comrade. <laughs> All right, in that case, <laughs> in that case, I'll just do the one liner now. All right. Yeah, the ranger just tries shooting angel eyes, gets nothing. Stab, stab. She looks up covered in blood. You see, that's your problem. I'm not trapped in here with you. You're trapped in here with me. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Alright, so here's... Here's the build for Ranger A. This ranger okay. is going to stay right where he is in attack instead. Okay. Oh. <clears throat> <clears throat> so he's going to be using the mortar arrow, which has, which is uh... basically arrow bolting. <laughs> so let me get the might on that. Uh, mortar arrow. So okay, it's not like okay. The upgraded version is like the uh, is like the thing, but no, he he does have extra bow range, so kind of arrow bolting, but not really. <laughs> However, it does do the same amount of damage, which is none. <laughs> the arrow explodes against your shield. Angel eyes, you are completely fine. But like I was saying, I'm not trapped in here with you. You're trapped in here with me. Yo. Alright, in the meantime... This Holy Knight's going to come down towards the dragon. A terrible decision, because the dragon imme immediately eats him. <laughs> See, it's not cannibalism! The dragon was right! <laughs> Why does everyone keep thinking it's cannibalism? They are completely different species. Like, I mean, holy shit! I don't like this. Whether or not you like the circle of life is not my problem. Uh, well, you see, you see, boy. <coughs> when we die, we become the grass. And mm -hmm. then the animals, they eat the grass. And so we are all connected in this great circle of life. Circle of life, yes, yes. <laughs> also, we'll stop speaking through the fourth wall. Make me, Scott. <laughs> this Holy Knight's gonna attack. Terrible decision, really. He gets a face full of water and then eaten. The other knights are starting to wise up. <laughs> Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, no, can't move through there. Seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, one, two, three, four. He's gonna attempt to attack Captain Dorcas. A terrible decision, really. <laughs> A terrible decision, really. Terrible decision, really. Oh, you're approaching me. Well, how about he? Royal scum? Uh, uh, you might actually do damage, actually. I only have 49, eight, uh, I only have 49 defense. But uh, you uh, still won't be able to take me down. Let's see. Dorcas is uh, captain's command. That doesn't, that doesn't activate. Beast room gives... Plus two defense. So. Cavalry 10. Let's go with Beckon Triangle Advantage. 
That's gonna be 21 damage on Captain Dorcas. I a, a good blow you made. However, now it's my turn. And he transforms into an orca. All right, so nice. 47 attack. 10 might. Versus defense. <laughs> Oh, as it turns out, you have weapon triangle advantage. That sucks. Ah. An alright decision, really. Hmm. Perfectly you reasonable decision. decision. You actually thought this through. Good on you. A tactically sound decision. <laughs> However, this does mean that they have the bonfire ready. Uh, let me see. Can Dorcas count it? Can Dorcas can make a follow-up attack? Find uh, out on the next uh, episode of Dragon Ball Z. 51 speed, so he can make the follow-up attack. And therefore, hey, hey. he can activate Bonfire. <laughs> nice. Who said fire and water can't mix? <gasps> Anyways, I'm going to kill you now. <laughs> Okay. Right, so half of his half of his defense rounded up, so there's gonna be 25 damage on the on the guardian knight. I'm going to kill you after doing this two more times. I'm being very patient, just letting you do this. You can't do it though. I believe in you. <laughs> All right, 42. All right, this mage knight. Do you need any uh? Do you need any help with that? By the way. Stop mocking me! Oh no, no, just, just, do you need some help? You know. Genuine curiosity, Six. man. Yeah. The mage knight is going to attack <laughs> the dagon now. So oh, okay, later then. <laughs> dagon, got a res of twenty-four. Oh, King Triton's not going to be very happy with this one. <laughs> All right, let's see. Mage knight, mage cav. Attack of 48. Might of 10. It's gonna be a neutral hit. 34 damage on the Dagon. Dagon takes uh is taken down to 31 HP. The Dagon Oh, I can't believe I just clicked away from roll 20 again. Just the dagon the destroys the, dagon. the platform. <laughs> oh god, we're on the void! It's the grid, it returns! The grid, it's back. All right, so the yeah. grid returns with a vengeance! And it's using water breath on the mage cab. It's gonna be 52 res. It's gonna be 8 damage on the mage cavalry unit. So he's going to tenderize him a bit. 50, 56 damage. And let's check the stats again. Dagon has 30 speed. Cav Mage has 26. So it does not double. Only not going to come down. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. This one's a poor decision. <laughs> Ah, uh, come at me, all of you! I could take all of you at once. All right, so that's gonna be fifty attack, forty-nine defense, weapon triangle disadvantage. 11. Zero damage against Captain Dorcas. <laughs> nice. Tink. Meanwhile, Captain Dorcas is going to retaliate. Forty-seven. Whereas the cavalry unit is ten. This is going to be a weapon triangle advantage hit. So, 18 damage on the Gold Knight. And Bonfire is ready again. <laughs> Excellent. Oh, this is going so much better than the other guy. Weapon Triangle Advantage, don't sleep on it. Anyways, prepare for destruction. Okay, have a good day. Alright, so 25 plus 18 equals uh, 43. That's going to take the guy down to... Uh, six health. 
But I still believe in you. And this maid is gonna come up to this guardian knight. One, two, three, four, five, and heal. Uh, let me check the mage's attack really quickly. <laughs> Alright, maid. 50 attack. 25 HP. Plus 30. Okay, so the, the guardian knight is back up to full. Alright, in the meantime, over here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, gonna be attacking Nizera. A poor decision, really, because, you know, Nazera's gonna take, like, zero damage from this. Mm -hmm. Alright, Nazera. Resistance is 45, plus attack, attack res solo. Alright, 48. And 10. No damage! Ding! 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 And I'm back, no Kings. Woo! Oh, come back. Oh, thank God. He's back, bitches. One, two, three, four, five. <coughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Woo, look, uh, we're about to die. <laughs> These things are trying to attack... Do or Wait, no, how's it going again? I don't even know anymore. This maid is actually going to back up a bit. <laughs> oh, hey. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then the maid, the dudes are coming! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Or hang on, I can lose seven. Hang on, one. Back. Back up. Back, you dogs! Back, back it up. Digs. Back it up. Back, you dogs! Back it up. Five, six, seven. Backing, two, three, up. Four, five, Backing six, up. Seven. Backing up. And now it is ally phase. There we go. <laughs> Alright. You're attacking a fellow beast! This angers the knowledge keeper! One, two, three, four, five, six. My staggering blow is now prepared. And the gold knight is going to die because, you know, it's the knowledge keeper. Okay, bye. No, wait, that's the other gold knight. Never mind. <laughs> Alright. I don't know if it's going to die. I might have to count this actually because they have high defense, but, you know, you know what I mean. Yeah. Sixty-two. Whoa! Sixteen plus sixty-two. Oh. Uh, fifty. Character skills, knowledge keeper. Well, first of all, What's furious that? winds, Prox. So yeah, uh, let's see. Knowledge keeper's attack sixty-two. Guy's defense is fifty, or no, the lower defense arrest. Sorry, excuse me. So this is going to do even more damage. Um, okay, you're excused. So that's yeah, Knowledge Keeper's got Dive Bomb, and uh, Librarian's Wrath Triggers because Denzel's right there. Hey. Yep. <laughs> Pretty sure he's fine. Yeah. No, he's this guy's fine. dead. This guy's totally dead. <laughs> well done, this Keeper of Knowledge. Justice. Thank you, Hero of Justice. Your, <laughs> your kind words please the Knowledge Keeper. I ship it. I was just about to say. <laughs> Mary is going to come up this way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Six, seven. Uh, let's see. Latifa. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Mudder, five, five, six. I'm going to attack this Holy Knight. Uh, let me check the effects of the Braxis. Just, really, just again, real quickly. The Braxis. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Which is less than or equal to the number of foes in two spaces. So, yeah, that Brax. The Holy Knight is now going to face the full wrath of this Abraxas tome, and I don't think it's going to survive. So, yeah. Holy oh, Knight Holy Knight! Upon the Holy Knight. And the Holy Knight is killed. And apparently, so is Queen's Internet. Uh... What? No, I'm still here! Oh, who died then? Uh, the, the other queen. <laughs> the oh, other shit. Sure. Shiner, Sh Shiner, apparently, for Mike, died. I we love a good cuss stream. That, I can't believe that Shiner became... <laughs> Please watch current stream. Please, Please watch current stream. Okay. Uh. Oh boy. Technical difficulties. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's not IR without him. Alright. So, allies. Other allies. Stanley. Uh, let me check the positioning really quickly. Mm-hmm. 
they need to they need to quickly check Stanley's ability. Navigator. It allies within cardinal directions of the unit within eight, with HP l less than unit. Deal plus ten damage during combat. Uh, I think Stanley's HP should be higher. Actually, hang on. Stanley. No, it's no, it's right. That's right. Fifty-two is right. However, most of the units have less than fifty-two HP, so Stanley is going to just be a battery. He's gonna he's gonna survey everything, look for where all the best uh, places to. Or the optimal place to position himself is one, two, three, four, five, six. I think Stand. that'll give the most. Mm. Five, six. There we go. That that should give the most results. Okay, Allison. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Rigid, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Uh, Quartza, get a heal. On. Who needs healing? Does anybody need healing? Uh, I didn't. Uh, I don't hang on. No. Technically, Daphne. <laughs> Daphne does need healing, yes. Mur also needs healing. Daphne Dude, oh, yeah, Mur needs healing, man. <laughs> oh, God, yeah. Did Una get healed from before? before? Yeah, let's uh, yes, search for this. Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. And she will see. Also, she's done to this. Technically, you could heal the Knowledge Keeper if you really wanted to. <laughs> I like you guys. You give me extra speed. Speed is great. <laughs> You're telling me. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Daphne. One, two, three, four. Um, just gonna stay there. Get, get, to get that extra movement as well. Armor T pose, gang, rise two, up. <laughs> five, six. And I think that's everybody then. Yeah? Great. Alright. We have five minutes, but do you want to fire the cannon? <laughs> They came here to kill us, but they forget! It's motherfucking opposite day! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Who do you want to attack? Uh, ooh, good question. Um... Una's range is cannon is her attack over two, which means that she can basically hit everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh, almost everything, but yes. Almost everything, but you know. A large okay, amount um... of things. Who would it be worth attacking? Like, who's the most danger right now? Who's the um, biggest danger? Hmm. That's a good question, actually. What about if you need this any... hoe up here? Can I see this guy? The Cantor, yes. Uh, let me grab the... Let me grab the... Oh, oh shit. The oh, Cantor. yeah, the Cantor yeah. would be a great target. We could take out <laughs> yeah. the Mathodigs. We could oh. take out all the Mathodigs at once. Oh, good, <laughs> yes. I think that would be a good option. Yeah, that's, that's our target. All right. Good play, good play. Let me first get the... I mean, we haven't All right. made the play yet, but good call. You know what I mean. Yeah. Yes. All right, Cantor. <laughs> His defense is 28. Okay. And you're firing a cannonball, which means it's a physical... Which means it's a physical attack. So... Okay, 28 minus... Uh, Una's... Uh, okay, Una's attack minus 28. 64 minus 28. We have, a, we have a calculator for this. Sixty-four, zero, eight. All right, forty-eight damage on the Cantor. <laughs> that was the Cantor getting hit by. I think a that was the Cantor. Yeah. <laughs> All right. It, it's you and me, old friend. She, you slowly rub the cannon. You ro slowly rub the cannon's barrel, very gently and gingerly. You are all a bad influence on this woman. So who do we want to give Una another turn so she can do it again? Please. <laughs> so do it one more game. Uh, hmm. Leon can reach. <gasps> Come hither, bestie. Okay. Okay, bestie. 
All right. You twerk at Una. Una has not, Una now has a second turn. Una can also Una has also given you experience points because you twerked for her. All right, so it's level 29. Uh Leon level 23. So uh 75 experience points. I think that's uh no. No, nope. okay. never mind. All right. Una, it's time to destroy. Rush. Kill. Exterminate. 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 Are you just the internet died you again? Finish? Shoot it with your last dying breath. Oh no! God yes. of all the times. All right, Una fires the cannonball one more time. The cantor takes it in the face. He collapses to the ground. He says, "Glory to Salata. As he dies from internal bleeding. Or it's a what? Salatar. Salatar. Oh, okay. The name of the evil earth dragon. <laughs> Come on. Oh, no, I just salads. I hate salads. <laughs> and the Mathadugs, they whimper and disappear. Oh. I almost feel bad for them. Almost. Almost. That they're evil almost. dogs from hell, so you don't have to feel super yeah. bad. <laughs> They're the only... All dogs go to heaven. All dogs come, came from hell. <laughs> and let, I will get Una's experience points for her. <laughs> all right. Uh, all right. China, can you hear us? Or can, are you... Are you uh, say something. He can hear, but she can't talk. Uh, I can okay. I can relay messages. Alright. At least she can hear. Yes. Alright, well, we have time for, like, one more move. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the guy was... Did we save Dorcas? That would be a good idea. That might help. All right. By the way, Una gets 50 experience points. Nice. 39 <sighs> kill would be... All right. All right. What are the matter these skills? The maid? Maid. The maid skills, yes. Yes. The maid. Maid D has this. All right. da, 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 da. Where's the item? There it is. Maid D. Ah, I see. Oh, she is carrying death. D for death. And do you want to know the other one as well? Wait, death is a colorless tome. You know what that means. <laughs> mm -hmm. Trixie, <laughs> you might have a new toy to play with. Uh, Trixie doesn't have a special, though, so... Ah, uh, shit, you're right. Jormungand is still needs... a better tome. <laughs> yeah. And Trixie needs to, uh, talk to people. <laughs> Well, in the meantime... Here's Maid C. Finder says, I agree! Mm -hmm. Alright, so we can... We'll kill one of them, but which should we kill first? Uh... Hmm. Maid C is much less of a problem for us right now. Yeah, she... She's a little bit further away. Hmm. I'll pick a maid, and then we can. Then we gotta be done. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. I don't think our cannonballs will be able to kill the maid, though. Is the thing. Yeah. We do so have we a warper. Just... That is true. We've got two. <laughs> we do have multi. We have multiple warpers. <clears throat> Uh, 
Uh, let's see what this. And I will also oh. say that while we don't have a, we also yeah words. <laughs> well, we don't have um, we have a mage killer, so yeah. I got it. I figured out. <laughs> okay. All right, Alex. What's your what's your plan? Loki, you woke up. Warp over me, hell. All right, Loki, all warp right, over right. me, hell. So, go ahead and do that. Cool. Uh. And then loop on to the other side. Gooch over here. I am going right. to uh, Zanbato, Guardian Knight. All right, the Guardian Knight is dead because that's a freaking Zanbato coming from color advantage. An Aruto. Cool. Gale Force. Ill wound. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and maids don't have very good defense, so. Uh, actually, let me check that. I haven't, we haven't fought a maid before. Or if we have, it's been a while. Yeah, maids have 10 defense. Maids have 10 defense. Hell yeah. Alright, so... Alright, attack plus 4 during combat. <laughs> well, first of all, experience for the killing the, killing the Guardian Eye. Because cool. that might affect the calculations. Just a little bit. Just a little bit, just slightly. Tad. Just a tad. Level 23, level 24, 75 experience points. Well up. Yay. Alright, now what? Cool. 48 attack. Alright. 48 attack. And then defense of the maid is 10. And this is going to be a neutral hit. 58 damage on the maid. Six. Leaving her with six. And then, enemy build log. Uh, no close counter. No, so, yeah, he does this again because he's fast. God. And the maid goes down. And we have also received the uh, death tome and the restore staff. I will put those in the convoy. And we are also out of time. So okay. thank you all for uh, thank you all for watching. Thank you all for bearing with us as we uh, as we dealt with a lot of technical issues this this stream. Uh, we promise it's not usually like this. Uh, if you're new, it, we, uh, we promise it's not usually like this. But it, apparently today it decided to be a very bad tech day for us. Yeah. Yeah. But we got through it. We got through it. Anyways, thank you all for coming. Thank you all for watching, and we will see you all next time. Uh, I don't know what's happening on Thursday and I, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I don't know what's happening on Friday and uh, Sunday. Because, we know. Uh, oh, we know exactly what's happening Sunday. What's happening on Sunday? Juno. DMP is really? not the Sunday. If that's what yeah, you're yeah, thinking. Yeah, Scott, DMP is not running not on Sunday. Sunday. Yeah, it's running. Oh, don't you Sunday look afterwards. like Boo Boo the Fool now? Boo I, Boo. I I am Boo Boo the Fool. Yeah, no, it's next Sunday. Yeah, yeah. Okay, then. Uh, not this that Sunday. makes things. But yeah, I... we'll see you all next time, next stream. See you all tomorrow for whatever is happening. All right. All Bye. Right. Take Later, care, guys. Bye. -bye.